Wizards, Witches and Muggles. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well. Today is Toy Day. <laughs> I have a problem. Good. Yes, I have a problem. But what's exciting is we're not just opening a Mini Browns Series 2. I've also got the collector's case. It's got five exclusive minis. Five exclusive special ones. We might even see some gold ones in this case, which I'm quite excited about. Not gonna lie. I haven't even opened this, so we're gonna reveal them together. But yes, I um, went a little bit crazy in Smith's Toys and got ten of these Mini Browns Series two for us to enjoy. <laughs> I'm really excited. Hopefully we have a lot less soy sauce in this video, but let's see. So if you want to see me open and reveal all of the things that are inside of these mini brands, we're going to be unboxing 50 miniature mini brands. I'm so excited. So if you want to see what they are, keep on watching. And if you're brand new to this channel, hello, welcome. Don't forget you click the subscribe button if you like to part of our weird magical online family. But let's go because... <sighs> We got a lot to open. Like I need another one. Mama Rackers. All right, I'm gonna start off with all 10 mini brands segments, like all of the balls, and then we're gonna be unboxing the collector's case because there's gonna be a few of them in there. Let's see if we can fill the case with just 10 of these balls. That would be very exciting to me indeed. Right, let's open our first ball of segments. I'm gonna leave the cheat sheet up to last. I promise not to forget the cheat sheet. Let's, oh my God, it's, oh my God. I bought this brand. I think it was this brand, but it was pumpkin spice. This is apple pie spice. It's so tiny. I wish the lids opened. It does make me sad that they don't, but that's a good start. <laughs> yeah, we're in, we're in. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> It's Heinz bar. Oh, it's a tiny little Heinz barbecue sauce. Oh, look how small it is. Oh, isn't it just darling? Oh, it's so sweet. I want to put all of these in my kitchen. Don't know why these make me so happy, but they do. Let's move on to the third one. Oh, okay. We've got the cheat sheet. We've got the cheat sheet. Let's move that to. Oh, we've got Hershey's cookies and cream. Look, there's a big debate about Hershey's, but Cadbury's is so much better than Hershey's. Hershey's tastes like the cheap advent kind of chocolate. Come for me, come at me, cancel me over saying that. It's just my opinion though. So this is a tiny little squishy packet. And um, oh, I do like it though. It's instantly recognizable branding, but squishy. Are these nappies? Oh my God, they're really squishy. It's a tiny little thing of diapers. This is Rascal and Friends premium diapers. It feels like actual packaging that you would get on those. Like, I li uh, that's quite impressive. Okay, the last one inside bowl number one. <sighs> Try it again. In bowl number one. <coughs> oh my God, were you worth it? No. <laughs> what are you? Dose and Co? Does anyone recognize this? Dose and Co, it's a uh, unflavored collagen, collagen peptides? Is it a moisturizer? Someone needs to tell me what this is in the comments. Right, bowl number two. Let's see what's inside. Oh, a nice easy, oh, oh. We've got a cart. Okay, let's build this little tiny shopping cart. Five minutes later. Oh. Actually, oh my goodness, it actually works. There we go, little tiny trolley. Adorable. Let's open this one. <gasps> Ooh, Mentos gum. So this is a really nice shape. It feels really good quality, really like it. Let's open another one. Ooh, cheat sheet. <gasps> oh, it's the laughing cow. <laughs> It's the Laughing Cow cheese spread. I did not know that they did a spread. I'm pretty certain that they don't do this in England. Look at that, it's tiny tiny cheese. Why is it so cute though? Oh. <laughs> Look, we've got a, oh, it's adorable. I was hoping for this one. It's a Heinz tomato ketchup. I have this in my cupboard downstairs, this exact one. That's so cute. This is my favorite. This is probably going to be my favorite out of the lot, but we'll see if we can beat the Heinz tomato ketchup. I think this is the last one of ball two. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> nude. Here's my nudes, guys. 
Oh my god, it's a cat food called Nude. I want to know the reasoning behind that. It's premium cat food. Oh my god, look, it's got the kibbles on the side. <laughs> Never heard of that brand, but wasn't expecting it to be cat food. Ball number two. This one. Oh, it's a box. Oh, Bessie's. Oh, toad in the all. Oh my god, it's so small. Tiny little Aunt Bessie's. Why is it so cute? But it's got like all the info on, like, this is so cool. Very nice. Cheap. Oh! <laughs> it's a tiny baby bell. Oh my goodness. Okay, I think we might have topped the Heinz ketchup. You could make this into the cutest little baby bell necklace. If I get dupes of this one, I'm not going to be mad. We got a dupe. But it's a good one. We got a first dupe, which is tomato ketchup again. Super cute necklace. Oh, I am gonna do it guys. Maybe I'm just gonna start a little business. Oh, we got our little tiny grocery bags. You guys know how I feel about these grocery bags. If you have watched season one, I really like them. I think they're very cute. Oh, we're in. Heinz spaghetti with sausage. I love spaghetti with sausage. I also love Heinz beans with sausage. Just a big sausage fan. Take that how you want. Okay, ball number four. What is this? This is a slush puppy giant candy spray. It's an interesting shape. Uh, <laughs> I'm not the biggest strawberry flavored fan, but it's okay. Is it good? TGI Fridays, what? This is spinach and artichoke cheese dip. Oh, oh, another tin. It was a good. Oh, I love the Heinz Big Soup chicken and vegetable. I, I actually like this. This is a brand that I genuinely like to have in my cupboard because it's chunky, fills you up. I like it a lot. That's very good. Do these stack? Sort of. Oh my god, we're getting some really good. This is probably my favorite series so far. Oh, we got another toad in all. Got another toad in the hole. <gasps> oh, she broke it. Okay, we got cheat sheet. What? Are you? Oh, we've got something new. <gasps> oh, cute. Look, it's a little Aunt Bessie's duck fat roast potatoes. Ball number five. Oh, we're in. Is it good? Oh, it's another TGI Fridays product. Okay. Oh, this, oh, oh, I love jalapeno poppers. This is, <laughs> I've never had them from TGI Fridays. Why do we not get these over here? They look incredible. So there we have it. Another TGI Fridays product. What is blue diamond almonds? Again, I don't think we have this in England, but they are roasted and salted almonds. I like the little pot. Oh, it's got the branding on the top of the lid as well, which is cute. It's the same on both sides. Very sweet. Have I just got another nappies, more diapers, but for older? Yes, these are premium training pants. Instead of soy sauce, we've got a nappy collection today. Ooh. <sighs> okay, we've got the cheat sheet and, ooh, something. Warheads, a new one. We've not seen these yet. These are Warheads all mixed up. Here's the back for those that want to see it. It's another squishy squishy. We're in, we're in. Is it good? You look. I don't want to look. Is it good? <gasps> it is good. It's so good. Oh, look, it's a Sensodyne. Oh my God. It's Sensodyne toothbrush and it's in like the proper, it's their pro enamel toothbrush. There's, guys. Is this the best one we've received so far in all of mini brands? Probably not, but it's so cute. We're on to ball number six. Let's see what's inside. Oh, almond breeze. Is this, oh, it's almond milk. Look at that. That's cute. I do quite like almond milk. I love coconut milk as well. Almond breeze, I don't, oh, this is another blue diamond, I guess, cause it's a nut company. It's a cute little box though. I love the packaging. Oh, Chopper Chups. Oh, I love Chopper Chups. These are the best of. So you get 10 lollipops in each packet. This is a very cute squishy packet. I like it. Very cute. Oh, another toad in all. Oh, oh. oh 
This one was unlucky. This is another Kershey's Cookies and Cream. And then, oh, it's another, oh, this is like all duplicates, this one. This one is Apple Pie Spice, which we've got as well. Next is our seventh ball. Let's see what's in there. Oh, I swear to God, if you're Apple Pie Spice yet. No, this is Cream of Tartar. Let's open this one. Ooh. Oh, the cutest little tiny mouthwash in the planet. It's another Sensodyne product. That is very cute. I like the color of it. Here's the label on the front and on the back. Oh, another tin. I think it might be a new tin. Oh, classic Heinz tomato soap. Cream of tomato soup, I may add. Oh, isn't it just so cute? Oh. Look at all of the information. It's literally like I've taken a can from the supermarket and zapped it with a shrink gun. No. Oh, the little tiny Heinz bean snap pots. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, it's adorable. There's four snack size pots of beans. Like, I love it. We've got one more left in this bowl and then we've got three bowls left and the collector's case. What are you? I do not recognize you. You are root. Yeah, we definitely do not have this in England. Root beer concentrate. Oh, it opens. Look, there's nothing inside of these boxes, by the way. People are always curious, like what's inside? Not a lot. <sighs> you better be a good one. Okay. Is it good? Oh, it's a repeat. What is in here? Oh, it's another build. It's another shopping cart. I'm not going to rebuild that. More nappies? That's another duplicate. This seems to be the duplicate ball. Oh, look, we got a Pez dispenser. Oh, that's so cool. Look, it even says Pez on the side. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, that's adorable. I really like that one. That one has like brought this ball back to life because they've been duplicates so far. Oh, another duplicate. I've tempted fate. I'm so sorry. We've got another Sensodyne mouthwash for the duplicate pile. We've got... I was trying to be cool and it didn't work. <laughs> we got two balls left. Let's go. Right, let's get in there. Oh, Ooh, a new packet. <gasps> Oh my god, cinnamon toasters? I don't know what these are, but they look amazing. Do -do -do. Oh, another Hershey's? They're really trying to make me like Hershey's today. Let's move on. Oh, Heinz, seriously good mayonnaise. I know it's mayonnaise, but it sounds fancy when you say mayonnaise. This is a really fun shaped jar. I like that. That's a good one. Oh, more almond, but wait, is it the same almond breeze? Are they the same? Yeah. Oh, yeah, they're the same. <gasps> oh, I used to love getting these for Christmas. It's um, Swizzle's Sweet Shop Favourites, and it's like an entire tub, like this big. That's so cool. I can't believe how small that is. I love that. The final one. I think this one's going to be good. I've jinxed it, haven't I? Okay, let's see what's inside. <laughs> We've got a golden one. I was just, I think I'm a psychic guys. Right, so this is the normal blue diamond. This is the golden blue. Oh my God, I can't cope. This is low sodium. It is slightly different, but it's a gold. We got a rare, ah, that's so cool. We've got another box cereal. This looks so nice. It's, we've not had it yet. This is Mum's Best Cereals Crispy Cocoa Rice. That looks delicious. I love chocolate cereal. It's so good. Mm, I'm going to let you look in this one. Beans. It's the classic beans. We don't have this yet. It's the Heinz beans. Oh, <laughs> look at all my little tins. Oh, I can start my own store. What are you? Oh, we have a duplicate, which is the Warheads all mixed up. Okay, the final, final one. Doesn't want me to open it. That's such a good one to end on. This is Dum Dums. We've had a box of these before, I think in series one. And it's a whole, like, plastic cart of them. That's such a good finale. That was a really good ball to end on. It had the special. I'm still like, whoa. Let's move straight onto the collector's case, which I'm 
so excited for. So here is the collector's case and it's got five exclusive minis inside. So it's got some golds in there. It doesn't tell you which ones are in there, but it's a case and you can put all of the ones that you've got inside. Now there's a few that we are definitely missing. I would have loved to have got that slush puppy. And I think the love heart, HP, Leon, golden. Okay, let's just open it on up. Are you ready? Oh, whoa, there's loads that we, ah! no, come back. Sorry, I ruined the moment. There is loads that we have not got. So there's some more behind here, but let's talk about the first side. The first one is Mentos sugar-free gum and it's in bubble fresh cotton candy. I love this pink edition. Then we've got oh, drumstick. Look, it's like a tube of drumsticks. I do like that. That's so good. No repeats. Then we've got Heinz spaghetti, just the normal spaghetti, not the one with sausage. Ha, ah, it's so cute. I wanna make like a million necklaces. And then the one I'm very excited about. Oh, wow. This is a slush puppy and it's got the slush in it. Look, look at it. I just wanna, oh, I love slush puppies. They're like one of my favorite things in life. They're just happiness in a cup. They're so cool. I love that. That's another top favorite. I'm not gonna be able to pick my favorites. Look, it's a Reese's Pieces. We didn't get any golds in the collector's case, which is sad, but look, a Reese's Pieces. Am I gonna put all of my little ones in there later on? Yes, I am. But first things first, let's take a look at our mini brand series two haul. So here is all of the ones that we got that were all different. This is such a good haul for mini brands. This is definitely my favorite series that I have opened. We definitely got quite a few repeats today, but we had more balls, so that is totally expected. Out of these ones, my favorite, the golden one, Obviously, that was a very special moment. Other ones that I adore from this particular collection is the tomato ketchup. I loved all the tins of soup, thought that was super cute. Loved this slush puppy. That's like a highlight of mine as well. The baby bell and the toothbrush were so cool. I really liked these. I love all of these products. My brain is going into creative corners, being like, what can I do with all of these that is gonna be absolutely adorable? I'm gonna definitely do some things. I cannot wait. Let's take a quick look at the duplicates before we look at the cheat sheet. These are our duplicates. We got a few Hershey's cookies and cream. We got a few Toji in the holes. We got a few good duplicates. I really like that I had a Sensodyne and a ketchup duplicate. Really cool. The baskets are always useful if you want to display these in a cool way. Very pleased with that and I just really enjoyed this series. I think because I also recognize more of the brands on a personal level. So like Heinz, all of the Heinz range and like Aunt Bessie's and I don't know Baby Bells and some of the sweets and things like I definitely recognize more than for example the toys range perhaps but yeah I really liked it let's look at the cheat sheet let's unfurl the cheat sheet so these are the golden ones and as you remember we got the 006, which is the blue diamond gold. This is the first time I've authentically got a gold one. I've had one in a collector's case before. Quite pleased with that. I would have loved to have got the golden slushy. Oh, there's some really cool glow in the dark ones. I don't think any of ours glow in the dark. Then there were some metallic ones that we could have got, including Hershey's. Then these are all the common ones. I'm not sure what the pink diamond means. Oh, those are in the collector's case. So we do have all of the pink ones, including the Reese's Pieces. Very cool. Then we had some TGI Fridays and some cereals at the bottom. Turn it over. There's a lot more in this collection. We have the slush puppy kind of collection and the, some of the sweets and the spices. Aren't best. Oh my God, good fellas, the peas, you could have got Little baby bells. Oh my goodness. I would have loved the laughing cow triangles. Then all of the tooth and I think these are beauty products. And then you could have got a full blown shopping cart and all of those as well. That's so cool. I really enjoyed this series. It's definitely one of my faves. Let me know what was your favorite thing that we discovered today in this mini brand series too. Leave a comment down below. And hey, as per usual, if you got this far in the video, firstly, thank you very much for watching. And secondly, give it a quick thumbs up. It really helps me and my channel out. And I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you're all doing really well. Lots of love. I will see you soon. Bye. <laughs> that
tiny baby bell. Oh, you're so cute. So cute. I'm making that into a necklace. It's happening.